What's up y'all, I'm Marcus B Gaming, and if you want a breakdown on the resilience perk and an idea how much you need in PvP, stick around and I got you. Thanks for clicking, and for more, hit the like and sub button. Let's go. Resilience is one of the three ability stats, like mobility for a hunter's dodge and recovery for a warlock's rift. More resilience lets a titan get their barrier back faster. Then for every character, this stat determines how much health you have in that bar at the top. Like the other stats, it only gets a boost in increments of 10. So 65 resilience is the same as 60 resil. And you don't get any more health after you hit 100. That's the max. A lot of smart math magician types, yeah I said math magician, have made full number charts in reddit and other spots. Thanks to these peeps, we have an idea of health values. I'll put links to some sources in the description if you really want to go deep into the numbers and so that these people get credit for their work, of course. And now if you want to take a look, I put together a simplified chart showing that at zero resilience, we start at around 186 health. I say around because Bungie rounds numbers up, not to show decimals. So this could be 185.5. It's hard to tell. But let's go with 186 at 0 Brazil and 201 at 100. So how much should you run? Short answer is never ever ever less than 30. I recommend 50 if you could swing it. 70 will let you survive an extra shot from most guns that fire bullets and 90 gives you the most health for the price. 100 is overkill usually but if you really want to go all out, go ahead. Personally, I love running 70 but never less than 50. The goal is to use extra resil to survive extra shots from most guns and those tiers will help. I hope this info gives you a better idea on the stat. If you got more info or an opinion, please hit the comments. And if this helps, a like, tapping the bell, and sub button is big for me. Thanks y'all, and I'm out.